or at having lost the toss and put in by our opponents zimbabwe is a very experienced side and on their home ground in home conditions long boundaries i would say that the way we started off it was a solid opening stand ramro production by asif and kushal burtal followed up nicely by another good partnership between rohit podal and kushal malla uh, before the game started off uh, we had set our mind towards target of around 270 280 and we wanted to see how it pans out how it unfolds so walking into the third fourth phase i mean i'm talking about between 30th to 40th over and then ensuring that the death over was last 10 overs we capitalize i think we missed a trick a little bit out there but then again you know uh, they are bowling in death was with lot more experience and they had some very clear plans and it did disrupt a little bit of our rhythm so that's the area probably we want to keep on getting matured at um uh, like i said experience side that we came across i am very proud of the way we batted and we put up the show if given a choice 290 to defend uh, we'll take it any day but considering the conditions considering the wickets that we are playing on over here i think we've got an idea of once we get in we may want to push a little more and get to somewhere around 310 320 see fielding is our biggest strength and it complements our bowling but reflecting at uh, yesterday's game the occasion the crowd i think uh, i'll try to say it in nepali manasik group ma upasthit hona avashyak ch in one ball battle and i'm sure the boys will reflect on that now having experienced this they will be little more switched on they know that it complements our bowling and i'm sure they will bring out that energy on the ground yeah 320 score and defending 320 score would have put a little more pressure on our opponents see look we came across a massive experience sean williams and craig erwin have played for zimbabwe for many years they know their home conditions well and they were able to hit the pockets uh, exactly the way they wanted to uh, we tried to attack a bit at times with the plans that we had but i think with the flat pitch we could have thought differently and we did acknowledge that at the end of the game a little more discipline and little more patience maybe could have worked for us yeah so plenty of positives like i said before ramro production by asif sheik and kushal burtal uh, that opening stand will go a long way for our cricket um, i think we can reflect at the preparation that we did in south africa and the challenges were a lot more over there because the ball was moving around laterally a lot more early morning and then coming into zimbabwe over here we got decent pitches quite good pitches early morning 9 o'clock start we used to have to be a little more careful and they did that they applied very well they had clear plans and they backed their plans so positives about that how to go about building your innings and then partnerships partnerships between kushal malla and rohit padol as well and that has been our strengths that skills we present in partnerships uh with bowling as well i thought we got an early breakthrough which was good again uh, gulshan ja also looked good with his uh, simple plans of hitting the deck and ensuring that he stays disciplined uh, sandy had a off day but we know what sandeep lamichami can bring to the team and we do know and we are confident about what he'll present in the next game uh having said that again like i said we want to be disciplined little we want to be a little more patient but lot of positives well confidence ebbs and flows no it's very natural but i don't think a game like this we can take it as losing confidence i'm sure the confidence is retained very well we are very proud of the efforts uh the journey so far we know how we have executed in different challenges different matches coming here in zimbabwe now with two practice games and this one important game which we played against zimbabwe we were consistently doing well with the bat we were close enough in some of the games so now it's just about being present to those uh, one ball battles i keep saying that winning mindset in those one ball battles winning those phases ensuring that the defined roles are intact and we'll play as a team and uh, we'll cross the line our nepali fans we can feel you virtually uh, the game against zimbabwe was full house and the crowd over there was supporting their home team 
but we were feeling it as if it was our TU ground and our fans supporting us in that game. So we can feel you all the time. Obviously, I'm sure we made you proud with the kind of efforts that we put in. And going forward again, we'll keep on thinking as if you know we are there on the ground. And this will be the efforts from our boys will be for our fans to make them proud, our nation proud.